need to kind of straighten my hair a bit, but there is a message to this, a broadcast PSA type stuff, something right out of 1992. That's right, folks, we're going to talk about Pizza Hut and Blockbuster. Now, obviously, the whole thing about that is I, I'm i pretty proud to say that I mess with, oh, yeah, what do you think of this? I'm just still getting used to it. I mean, I don't have to do the the kind of girly, guyish thing. I could have, like, a strand here do something like that. I just don't know. I don't know if I want to go with like maybe the Van Halen, Halen style or something. I almost feel like I need to take up guitar lessons. I mean, I just need like the bang going down like that Johnny Depp movie. But yeah, I like the hair in the shot. So I'm gonna just some of it up, some of it back. All right, so, yeah, I just can't, I was in the basement thinking there was, there really wasn't too much slicker than a weekend where you, where you had a weekend where it's like, okay, I don't have to do anything this weekend, I'm going to go, and this is 1988, 1992, 1996. I'm going to head to Blockbuster, after that I'm going to head to Pizza Hut, and I'm just going to have a night. How many times, classic things, that's the kind of theme that I've been trying to bring to Acidic Roots recently. You're going to be seeing some Contra videos, you're going to be seeing some Ninja Turtles videos, you're going to be seeing stuff like that. Frenchy Talent, the Artifact of Pessimism, the NES Controller bunch of different stuff that's just bang right out of 1987 or something it's definitely something i mean now that the not just the nintendo is turning 30 but we're nearing the super nintendo turning 30 you got to start paying homage to these games before it's too late so i definitely had no problem with saying this and i always thought i mean that was you know before netflix came out Blockbuster was the coldest thing walking. If you had that job, it was obvious. I mean, it was, it was the most simplistic thing. Probably didn't pay much more than nine or ten bucks an hour, unless you were the manager. But there was just something about it. I mean, all you had to do was just stand there and know where all the movies were and games. So this is as simple as that. I mean, really, obviously, it. it I'm just gonna kind of flip my hair at how simple a job like that would have been. You just can't argue with it. I mean, you really can't. So yeah, Contra is going to pop up. Contra is definitely going to pop up. And Contra is definitely going to pop up. I might, I'm probably going to feature a lot more games. I just felt like Damn it, you really can't see that well out here. I mean, I've got three lights on and it just doesn't seem to matter. I keep trying to walk, but yeah, so NES is going to be here throughout this year. I mean, that's definitely, and this is, you know, as far as this is concerned, this is not just year three we're talking about. This is the f season four of Acidic Roots, gnarled up. How would you not like that? Be honest. You have to speak truths to know truths, man. I sound like Hyde or something. That's just another person. Yeah. Your goals are unrealistic. You're never going to get anywhere without guitar, man. Do you ever want to be on the cover of Guitar World? It's going places. We're on a stairway to the top. And there is no other way we're going to get there other than the, the skills that are ingrained in your knuckles. And f they're ingrained in your fingers. Feel the power surging through them at your fingertips. I'm gonna 
do.